Woo! Time now for the mix. Boy, my butt feels really nice right now. My quads feel. Really? Yeah. Yeah, never, never felt this nice, butt-wise. Okay, <laughs> let's get to the mix. <laughs> First off, oh, you've got a story about a fisherman. I do. Mm -hmm. Fisherman who maybe or may not have used his butt to stay warm. <laughs> you've got to use your butt to put that thing in. <laughs> <laughs> it's a stove. It's a stove. <laughs> he wants to go fishing and thought, how do I warm myself up? He lives in Serbia. And he doesn't light the fire because he puts a cardboard between his stove and the vest, and that's how he's not like blowing himself up there. But apparently he has now taken up fishing. Oh, something just dropped off the stove. What was that? I don't know. Maybe it was a grilled cheese sandwich. Or <laughs> well, maybe he grills the fish. Oh my God, I can't believe that. But that's what you do when you're cold. Let me tell you about this one. This is a story out of Seattle. Take a look at this picture. Now, if you're a fan of the Seahawks, you love this thing. You can't wait to get your butt in a car like that, oh, right? Yeah. So, this is from, they don't know who this fan is, but apparently some Seattle Seahawks supersonics, sorry, some Seattle Seahawks super fan painted his car to look just like the Hawk, and this thing retails, by the way, at 250 so you must have a lot of money to do up your car like that. Time now for nice. a brand new polka. From the Stand Comedy Club in New York City, Carrie Cottett, Liza Petrosian, and the Polka Brothers. <laughs> 